So Super Rugby has finally made it as a top sport on the world stage. How do I know this? When you Google Super Rugby now, you get this. I've been waiting for this for so long because I know it's a small thing and it's kind of petty of me to make a video about this, but for so long, every other major sport, at least the ones that I pay attention to, so things like the NHL, the hockey, and ice hockey in America, you know, the NFL, which I don't watch a lot of, um, the NBA, the English Premier League, other football soccer leagues around the world, even the NRL, which is the, the Australian um, Rugby League. If you Googled it, you got the schedule and it said the time in your region, like what time the games were on. Some of them have got the results like uh, clickable. So when you click it, it expands and um, takes you to a news story or takes you to a YouTube highlights video or whatever, depending on which sport, different sports have different weird things with the rights to the coverage and that kind of thing. But still, Super Rugby's finally got it. I can't believe they finally got this. It's been so long. I've been, I asked for it. I'm, I'm going to take some of the credit because I sent Sanzara a... Uh, they got a form on their website that you can fill out. I sent them a message maybe a year ago and I was like, every other sports league has this. Can you please look at getting this? Because it's going to promote, you know, Super Rugby. That's why I missed the, the Rebels Sun Wolves game the other day because I ended up looking at the Super 15 website and it had the wrong time on. So, yeah, I'm pretty chuffed. Pretty chuffed. Um... Just makes it easier um, for us fans to, to see when the games are on, see where the results are at, so follow the news. Um, you don't have to go digging on a second website, the information's all up there up front. Um, hopefully at some point they can incorporate the highlights, because Sands are pretty good with their highlights on YouTube. So you know you can see every game's highlights usually uh, next day on, on YouTube, so they're pretty good. I wish they are a bit longer, they're, they're pretty much bare bones highlights. Um, but still, um, it's, it's good. Uh, and interestingly, some of the, the things on here I never knew, like the AME Park where the Rebels play is actually Melbourne Rectangular Stadium ground. That's I thought it was just a, a, a filler, a place filler. I thought Google had got it wrong. But that's the actual name of the ground. AME Park is just like the corporate name. That's a pretty cool name. Like they should name Forsyth Bar where the, the Highlanders play like Rugby stadium with a roof, because that's what it is. It's very descriptive. Eden Park should be like half empty stadium in the middle of a suburban neighborhood. Catchy. But no, in seriousness, it's a really good thing for Super Rugby um, to finally just be Googleable in an easy way. Um, they still need to get some of the details right, like on this screen. They've got super15.com as the website, but that's not actually the official website. I know they've got probably more information than the official website does, and I use them a lot as well. Um, but like I said, there was a mistake on the scheduling the other day. So the official website's actually a different one, so I've emailed Google to correct that. So we'll see how long they, um, they take to get on that one. But uh, yeah, it's just all good for the game. I know Super Rugby's had a bit of flack for, um, you know, for not being well organized and just not doing things well. And to be honest, I don't even know if this comes from Google or this comes from the organization. I would imagine the organization goes to Google and asks it to be put up and they have to provide them with some information. But um, either way, it's just a good thing for us fans and it's a good thing for Super Rugby. So pretty happy it's on there. And it's always nice when like you put something in a suggestion box and it comes true. You, you, you take the credit for it in your heart of hearts, even though it was probably something at a large corporate level that didn't involve you at all but still it's nice to have all right guys so let me know if you use that function for any other thought uh sports um any other info you think it could could use because i know like i said some of the other sports do highlights and stuff which is cool but let me know your thoughts i'm curious it's it's not much of a video this one but um i just thought i'd share anyway guys i'll um catch you later